All right, morning everybody. How to metal detect. Now, Jen, behind me, my partner, you've never metal detected before, correct? Mm -hmm. So this, you've never held a metal detect. This will be your very first time. So I'm going to show you guys these days how easy it is to be a metal detector. So I'm going to turn around here and I'm going to ask Jen, the first thing to do is take your finger and just hit the on-off button, push the on-off button. And we're using a White XLT, which is a really nice uh, unit. And as soon as she puts it on, it's going to go through a battery check mode. And then it's going to come to a uh, mm -hmm. something that says preset pro uh, programs. And all you have to do, you can move, you have arrows here that can move it up and down. Mm -hmm. And you want to raise it up, then you want to push enter. Okay, and then you can pick whether you want it to go for coins, coins and jewelry which I usually use because it's, uh, yeah, you can take the arrow and then you can push enter. And what that'll do is then you need, that'll allow you to uh, kick out a lot of crap that you don't want to be digging, okay? So now it's, what does it tell you to do? Raise the loop to your to wife waste. level and push enter. And that's going to balance, it's going to balance the unit. In other words, it's going to check ground conditions. Now it tells you lower to the ground and then push it again. Now it's going to balance the ground. Now as you watch her sweep back and forth, you want to try to keep the unit low and uh, parallel to the ground. A lot of people sweep and they come up real high up the sides. It's what I call uh, disking or uh, scalloping. You don't want to do that. You want to keep the unit. Uh, you want to keep the unit kind of flat to the ground, hovering maybe an inch off. And as she moves back and forth, you can go a little faster there, sweeping. Sooner or later, she's going to hit a signal here. Okay, now she's right over top of something. And it's showing you that it could be what? Like a nail oh, no. there. Yep, you keep sweeping. Now it's telling you it could be what? Some money. Money. Now, she's going to use the trigger. There's a trigger. Move your finger for a second. If you look under there... You can see a trigger, and she's going to pull back on that trigger while she sweeps. Pull back on it and held it, keep holding it back. Listen how the sound right yeah, rises and falls as she right sweeps here. over it, okay? Okay, so what we want to do is make a little mark in the center right there. Where it is, of course, I don't use this, but just to show you now, now I'll go get the digging tool and we'll see what we, Jen got her first find. Are you excited? Yeah. What could be down there, huh? Silver. All right. Silver probably not time. silver, but uh, we'll probably get some today. So <laughs> let me uh, get the digging tool here. And we also have what's called a uh, pin pointer. And I turn that on and you see as it gets near metal, it goes off there. So. I've got a great digging tool too, and this thing is a nice self-defense weapon too. It's got yeah. the uh, scabbard there so your hand doesn't go forward. Alright, so we'll go ahead and dig. That should have also told you how deep it is as you sweep over it. You know, the nice thing. So what you want to do is take it and sweep over that again. And it's telling you it's about an inch and a half deep. So we should be able to use the probe now. And there it is. We're getting a signal. It's right on the side. There. We'll dig it up. And we'll see what we got. There's something there. And what do you got? Metal there? And that's it. That's your first find. It looks like a piece of uh, common metal. And you should expect that all day long. So... You broke your cherry now. Now you're going to start detecting them. Good detectors always fill up their holes again and make the site as if they've never even been there. And then you're always welcome as a detector. So that's a basic intro of how to metal detect. Feel pretty good? Yeah. All right. So we'll get going now.